I need to delete this. This was in 2006. Jeez, the last time I tried to play this was in 2006. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, let's erase this. We don't need it. Yeah, I only played this, um... I played it briefly once. And, uh... For whatever reason, I just never stuck with it. Yeah, single player. We don't have a choice. Hey, Jertka! How are you? You ever play this game before? Never really played this game before, but I had it. It's really designed for four players, but I hope this works out. Single player. Ages flowed by. The wind sorcerer Vadi broke free of his prison and kidnapped Zelda, the princess of Hyrule. Princess Zelda's childhood friend Link used the power of the Four Sword to defeat Vadi and seal him away once again. And for a time, the people of Hyrule believed that their land was safe until bad guys came. I can hear your voice. Oh, the GameCube controller is so comfortable. I haven't used this controller in a long time. You like the GameCube controller, Chertka? You have the GameCube, don't you? Or at least you did? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. But we're gonna give it a shot. We're gonna give it a shot, single player. I mean, we have to beat it anyway for the Zelda Thon. So I'll, I don't know if this will be great single player, but we'll do it anyway. Alright, we gotta go to Hyrule Castle. Yeah, I'm able to play Triforce Heroes on the 3DS. Uh, I played that with Auli. <clears throat> um, and also, I played it with uh, Forsaken. We can do that because it's online play, but this does not, obviously. And wow, it's kind of blurry. That's kind of disappointing. Just missing the control? You could probably get one on Amazon, right? They're pretty cheap now. I think you can get one brand new. Pretty cheap, in fact. I, I got this white one. Um back during the Wii days. I mean, I guess that was a couple of years ago, so I don't know if you can get one brand new still. Maybe you can. Yeah, it's kind of blurry. That's... That's weird. I mean, I know I'm playing it in composite, but I never... I never had this problem before. How does the stream look on your end, Jerka?
Yeah. Okay, I'm glad it looks good on the stream. Yeah, it's a little blurry, but the text is at least readable, so that's, that's the most important thing. It's definitely, I can, I can see what's going on. Sword guards the seal. I know what's gonna happen. I don't I hate it when they give us a choice, but there is no choice. We're split into four links. <laughs> accepted the destiny of the hero. I accepted nothing. Dark forces. Turn the sword to its full strength. Find the source of that power. Force gems. Okay. No one asked him. I had no choice. And we gotta rescue Princess Zelda. Of course. Level one. <laughs> So the graphics look great. Worried about finding Patty. Find the six shrine maidens. Shadow Link. I call him Dark Link. We need force gems. Gather the four. Or once one with the L or Y button. Okay. We can do formations, okay. <laughs> this is kind of funny. Oh, we found the force gem. Oh, you you just find the force gems in the in the grass and shit. That's weird. Let's see. So. See, like, why couldn't they just? Zoom out and use four controllers instead of using four GBAs for this. You're trying to tell me like they couldn't make this game work? Like, honestly, what they could do is they could port this game to the the Switch and give it online play. That would make it so much better. Look at these force jumps, they're all in the grass. Let's do a different formation. <laughs> it's kind of cumbersome to always switch. Let's go. What is it saying? Gather all four at the arrow? So the graphics kind of has like this improved a Link to the Past style, which looks great. Like the graphics are so good here. Hey, I'm on the GBA SP now. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, I figured out how to do formations. Let's 
do the tutorial, even though we know how to do it. <clears throat> Box! Got it! Wide! Got it! Long! Bingo! Yeah. Mm-hmm, yeah, that's probably it. Um Definitely though, like you can see like you can see like there's a shadow of a cloud moving overhead. So they added like some new effects that look really great. Oh good, we're getting force gems. See, I knew it was worth it. You gotta do all the tutorials even though you know what to do. And also it can zoom in and out. So that's that's something that a link to the past couldn't do. So we can do this zooming in and out thing, which is pretty cool. We just kind of look around for force gems. We gotta do a formation. Yeah! Force gems. Fuckers. So it takes some uh, some sounds from uh, Ocarina of Time, so that's kind of cool. Let's fuck up these guys. Oh, shit. Let's do the cross formation. Much safer. Physics are a little bit better than in a, a Link to the Past. So we can go back over here. Adds a little bit of Wind Waker effects to it all, too. Like when things explode and stuff. We know which formation we need. Hey, boomerang action. Okay. Oh, you can keep it hovering in place. That's cool. That's pretty cool. <coughs> so can we pick up... Oh, we can pick it up. Nice. All the force gems. In that big one. Got it. Hey, we're figuring all this shit out. Cool.
crappy product placement? <clears throat> what do you mean? We're still in Game Boy Advance SP mode. Gotta lift the... Yeah, the Game Boy Advance SP, like, when it goes into that mode, there's a noticeable decline in, in graphical quality. This is the Fire Rod. Nice. Ooh, cool. I like this. Yeah, the graphics when it's in the GBA mode is pretty, pretty bad. What is this? Is there anything else to do here? No? Okay. Yeah, like back in the, uh, when you're actually using four GBAs, like everyone would see this on their GBA screen. Cool. I feel like, honestly, they could have done this without the GBAs. You know, like, you don't need a GBA to do all this stuff. Everyone could just be using one screen. What What about this requires the GBA to be used? Oh, nice. Yeah, it is. Like, this part, like, like normally everyone would be seeing this on their GBA. Like, everyone, each person has a GBA, right? But there's nothing stopping you from just changing the entire scene to this, you know? <laughs> like, I mean, I, I really don't get why, like, they didn't need to have this stupid connectivity bullshit with the GBA. It was totally unnecessary. Like, we have to buy four GBAs just to play this game? Fuck you. Hey, it's Dark Link again. so far it's pretty cool yeah exactly you would have to control the game with the GBA which is really uncomfortable to hold and you would be using you know, the d-pad instead of the analog stick which I mean I guess it's okay um, but yeah the cable <laughs> you had to use the link cable <laughs> Weapons. How do I? S 
man, you can't switch weapons? They disappear after a little while. So there's no way to switch the continue, choose an area, choose a game? That's weird. How do you ch how do you select the the boomerang though? That fucker. Yeah, yeah, it's it's pretty good. It's not bad. It's actually kind of pretty cool. These fuckers. A, we're in GBA mode. I remember this from A Link to the Past. It's a tingle, that fuck. Tingle-esque pastime collecting force gems is all the rage. <laughs> Would I buy a car from Tingle? That guy looks like a swindler. Hell no. It's a scammer. Uh, press B button to dive. Okay. Okay. You can dive underwater to collect force gems. Notice something kind of weird. You can actually use that to close that out. Like why? Why would I ever want to close it out though? So I can't see what I'm doing. Another two uh, side scrolling section. Let's talk to this guy. Yeah. You can't jump here, though. We have to wait. Oh. That's not what I wanted. Where'd it go? Wait, wait, we're going back. It disappeared, what the hell? Did I pick it up? Maybe I did. What's, what's this over here? Such a ripoff, we lost them all. Yeah. You can't. This is kind of lame. You can't permanently save items. You have to pick them up and drop them, so. Right. Yeah, these are 
graphics are nice. I like them. I really like the improved 2D look to it all. I wish they would make another game like this, or like a, a modern version of this. It could even be the same game, just updated. Imagine doing that with four players. Yeah, it's easier, but it's a pretty basic puzzle. What's over here? There's like a couple of these routes. Okay, this leads nowhere. Yeah, the puzzles are pretty straightforward so far. Um, that's okay. I'm not expecting, like, anything super complicated. I mean, they can't... Oh, man. They obviously can't be too... I don't get it. How do I pick them up? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Alright, let me think. Like, it doesn't want to pick them up and bring them over here. It's just weird to me. like that. Throw them. Oh, okay. No, 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 that still won't work because someone will be left behind. Let's see. Leave. Is there like a stone or something we can put on it? Oh wait, I know, I know. <laughs> that works. Yeah, you just have to push that stupid button. Okay. There we go. Yeah, I've been playing Triforce Heroes with Owly and Forsaken. Um, definitely the puzzles in that game are more interesting. Uh, have more thought put into them. And are harder to solve. They have a level of complexity that is not on the same level as single player 
Zelda, but definitely more complex than this. are missing. That's okay. There we go. But there's something leading up here. Nice. but even honestly like it's so simple I'm not even sure if it's other than the novelty of playing with friends it doesn't even seem like it's required we already have the boomerang isn't that a cheap cheap from Mario is this like a Link's Awakening reference those should be sophisticated something that doesn't that you sleep for years to come, you need to study their mastery. Yeah, and they kind of address that problem in Triforce Heroes. So, yeah, Triforce Heroes is kind of like the evolution of this game. It's this game done properly, because you need to have three people to play that game. And it's really fun, actually. And that's a game that you really, you can't do single player. It just wouldn't work. Oh, we gotta, we gotta do this. <laughs> this is like the hey, we annihilate the fuck out of those guys. Hoy, hoy. Let's see. 
Oh, nice. You got beams now. Look at that beam. That's really cool. The beam looks great. Yeah, I would say this is, um... Wait, we need a formation, maybe. Formation time. Wow, we're fucking them up. Fucking hell. Definitely more combat in this game than in Triforce Heroes. That's good. I like that. I know what formation we need. Let's talk to the owl first, though. <laughs> Okay, let's do it. It's a little bit too wide, though. Nice. Not as bad as I was afraid it would be. Hell yeah, I want to save. Okay. Yeah! Wonder how many levels there are. <coughs> Classic Zelda theme? Classic, uh, Hyrule theme, I guess? Yeah. I just wish... You know, like... Yeah, this game would have worked with just controllers instead of GBAs. I can't see anything. What the fuck? <laughs> Oh, here we go. Yeah. Definitely would be fun with, like, four people playing at once. I really don't see why the GBA is necessary, though. I'm not seeing it. There is absolutely no point, in fact. I really like the graphics. I I even like the graphics in this game more than in Triforce Heroes. Because Triforce Heroes uses 3D graphics and actually it uses the 3D engine pretty well. So I just prefer these 2D graphics. They look so much better. You know, the controls feel good. They feel really good. Everything feels good. Oh, it must be this one. Oh, yeah, it's a little blurry. If I were to guess, um... If I were playing this on my CRT with a component cable, instead of composite, it probably would look better. In fact, I might test that out offline. I suspect it looks a lot better on, like, a real CRT. 
Do you still have a CRT TV, Chertka? For old school gaming? I know in Germany, you guys, uh, you guys don't even use composite. Uh, you, got, you guys have RGB. For the longest time, I used composite for everything. I didn't even know about component. Um, relatively recently, in your bedroom, a nice big CRT. I say relatively recently because it was like only just in the past couple of years I got component cables for all my old consoles. But ironically enough, I don't even use them any. I don't even use them because I don't really play the old systems unless I'm streaming. And if I'm streaming, I'm not using component cables anyway, so... So like uh, RGB and and S video and stuff, the max frame FPS is 30, right? It can't do 60 frames per second. Pal has 50 FPS. <clears throat> what about NTSC? Yeah, because I know that whenever I'm streaming a game that is natively 60 frames per second, like Splatoon 2 or Mario Kart 8, it's not running in 60 frames per second. It's, it's dropping the frames and running in a lower FPS, even in S video. So NTSC can do 30, 60 as well. Okay. Might be the, the converter box that I'm using then. Probably only will support 30. Whether I like it or not. For streaming, but unfortunately, um, if the game runs at native 60 FPS, and especially if it's a multiplayer game, it's it's unplayable for me. So I can't I can't play it. Yeah, it's good for streaming, but unfortunately, what I see, like how I actually play the game, is also what you guys are seeing. So if it's running at 30 FPS when it's supposed to be 60, it looks choppy. It looks pretty bad. Okay. Gee, I wonder how this puzzle works. Okay. 
Actually, that won't work. It's hard for me to remember which one's which. Nice. Nice. Out of the way, bozo. There's goodies here. Uh, but how do you get to it? There it is. Okay. <coughs> and there's another one. Two hundred. I saw a blue man group in Las Vegas. It was really cool. Blue man group. No! Are you kidding me? Oh, these are the evil fairies. You need the. Uh, you need magic power. But you do remember them. Oh, you had one in in, in uh, Berlin. That's cool. Guess there were no translation problems since they don't speak. It's just trial and error. Watch, watch me fall in there again anyway. I don't know if I want to do formations. Combat's definitely better in this game than it is in Triforce Heroes. I like it. This one? There might be more. Oh, there they are. <coughs> Toss him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this guy has no friends. This guy's a loser. Uh, how do we do it? 
Trump built secret rooms into his tower? <laughs> Are people saying that? I don't know. That'd be pretty fucked up. That'd definitely be fucked up. All right, now we can switch to the the bow and arrow, uh, but we still need to light torches, I think. So hold on, we'll switch to that later. What about you? Do you think that he built secret rooms into his tower? He has secret passageways? He's not cool enough for that kind of thing, though. He's too much of a loser. Only, that's like a cool thing. That'd actually be pretty cool. Although, probably illegal. There's a Netflix series called Trump? That's weird. Let me guess, it's about Trump. Oh, they're saying that he has secret rooms? Do they have any proof, though? There needs to be some evidence if they're gonna assert that. This is kind of weird. He has mafia ties? I didn't know that. Oh, you can attack these things. I didn't know that. I wouldn't be surprised if he did. You know, usually these rich, old white men, they do have mafia ties. There it is. Change the boomerang. It's pretty dark, but hopefully the next area will be brighter. Yep, we need this. Oh, nice. All the weapons feel good. The way the weapons move and everything. They all feel great. This looks so cool. So 
one is unusually hard. Yeah! Oh, that's so satisfying. Okay. Cohen was the major attorney for the most powerful mafia family. Cohen introduced Trump to the mafia in the 70s. Mafia controlled the concrete and cement production during his rise. It was impossible to get the best place as a man without the agreement of the mafia. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. All these rich white guys, they're, they're all connected to organized crime. They're all crooks, as Nilavani would, would say. I don't know if she ever called them all crooks, but, like, she definitely, uh, said they're, they're criminals, and, yeah, I'm saying, yeah, they're all crooks. <laughs> that doesn't, that doesn't surprise me. So how do I get this? I would need the boomerang. Oh, well. other one. I got a feeling it's gonna be bad, guys. Oh, okay. That's good. Nice. Dark Shadow Link. Again? I hate that fucker. Okay, I get it. 
dead yet? Yeah! Pretty cool. Not bad. Not a bad uh, boss fight. Thank you, Trutka. This guy's giving me tips to stuff I already figured out. Yeah, the boss fights in Triforce Heroes are much more complicated. They require much better cooperation. Much more complicated. <laughs> I need more force gems? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh man. I gotta do it all over again? That's bullshit. Oh man. I can't believe it. If you don't get enough force force gems, you have to do it all over again. <laughs> Fucking bullshit! Alright, now I have enough. Can I go forward in time now? Okay, good. Okay, okay, we're okay. That's not as bad as I thought it would be. Ah! Alright. Yeah. Whew. Alright. Yeah, I want to save. I wonder how many levels there are. Uh, I'll be right back, I'm just gonna get a drink. Okay, I'm back. Hmm. Judging from that... that thing above the continue... thing is, uh... all these little... crystal things, so I'm assuming we need to save... There's probably six levels. Thank you, Chertka. <laughs> Terrible fiend. So far, Cherka. Is it okay? Yeah. 
graphics on the other hand look really shitty you can't jump here either it's not the best Zelda game um, as a single-player experience but it's not terrible either
There we go. Wait, this is just like a link to the past now. This is just like the castle link to the past. Let's see, we can go that way. <coughs> we can go. Let's go up here first. Hey, we can go that way too. Let's see all the places that we can go to before we go through any of them. So, quite a few places. Recently played a few GBA games on your Nintendo DS. Four Swords was one of it, because of A Link to the Past. So you had some friends to play Four Swords with? You can play Four Swords on the DS with other DS's wirelessly? Because I actually do have Four Swords on my DS as well. You would need exactly four people to play with, right? You need the link cable even for... even when you have it on the DS? There's no... I'm confused because there's nowhere to plug the link cable into the DS. It doesn't support it. Oh, which one should we get? The wire rod? adapter? I didn't know that. That you can plug into your DS? The DS? Original DS or DS Lite? Because I have the DS Lite. was on the original DS and not the, the DS Lite. Original DS, the DS Lite, or the DSi, though? There's like three DSs at least. Shoot out. 
the second edition, so that's the DS Lite. There we go. Hey! I'm a fucking genius! The XL was only made for the DSi version, uh, which I, I did not get that. So we can jump down there. Go here. Wait, we're just back to where we started. I'm, I'm so confused. Yeah, the first version, like, I actually thought it looked kind of cool, but, uh, yeah, it was kind of, kind of chunky. What the hell? I'm so confused. Um, I have a white one. I wish I got the black one, but at the time it wasn't available. Made sure not to repeat that mistake when I got the 3DS, so I got a black 3DS. XL. Which is of course the best one. Uh, except it's not, because there is the... The new 3DS. The Switch is, is a hybrid. It's a gaming tablet. So, yeah, we won't be seeing any more portable Nintendo systems because there's, there's just no need for them anymore. We have the Switch. The Switch is good. Yeah, I play the Switch all the time with Owly. It's so much fun. Here we go. Stream the Switch? Yeah. Um, I mean, I tried. Uh, like a few times. One second. Um, the problem is, we couldn't stream Splatoon 2. Uh, because, uh, <clears throat> because of what I was talking about before, the, the, he was dropping the frames. The game runs at a native 60 frames per second, but it was only streaming at, uh, I can only play it at less than that, and it was unplayable, because a game like that needs to be played at 60 FPS. Uh, but there are other games that we can play. So that's, that's not a problem. You can definitely do Breath of the Wild one day. That is a pretty long game. But we'll do that one day. Don't need
need to worry about that. I don't know how you attack this guy without getting fucked over. We need the... Uh, we need arrows. Can't use the bow because um I don't have all the weapons equipped. In order to use the bow, you have to go back and get it. Oh, no, no. I'm about to die. Like, the item system in this game is annoying. When you when you pick up a new item, you drop your old item. So there's no inventory. have enough force things though. Nope. Resistance is over. Thank you. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Shoulda known. Usually the the thing like stays anyway. Let's see. Running off to that fuck. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
and the extra hearts are they only last for one level so that's pretty disappointing it's not a permanent upgrade I don't know why I did that anyway. It's gonna be a little shorter stream tonight. Alright, what do we need? See, this is the other problem. See, like, if I don't... If I can only carry one item at a time, it really sucks because I don't know what item I need. I have to just guess. Alright, last time we had trouble because we didn't have the bow, so let's, let's get the bow. But I, I have to just guess because I have no idea what item I need next. Alright, so... Oh, okay, I need the bombs. Okay. Then why give us all these different items? What's the point? Like, the, the room that's literally right next to us is dictating what item we need. Yeah, luckily they they don't penalize us if one of the links is in the line of fire, just whichever one you're controlling. Except if you're controlling all four, then yeah. are what we need. Mm -hmm. 
Check the other ones too, just in case. Oh, there it is. Another one. I guess we can go in either one. Don't think we need any more of these things, but we'll get it anyway. and do the same thing. Does this fucking castle have? There's a million levels! game than in um, Triforce Heroes, so that's cool. There's more puzzle solving in Triforce Heroes. Do you have a 3DS, Chertka? You don't, I don't think, right? actually has head tracking because like um, the original 3DS has uh, a 3D effect but you, you have to keep your head still which is really annoying but the new 3DS can actually track where your head is and can give you the 3D effect no matter where your head is had too many games game overload there's some really good games for the 3DS though like uh, Samus Returns. Allie's been playing that a little bit. Oh, I know what to do. Go this side. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. 
that's fair enough. That's actually why I passed up on the Vita. I could have gotten the Vita, but every time I thought about it, it just doesn't have enough good games for it. There's some good games, but none of them are really killer apps. And really, that's that's what you need. You need a good killer app. You know what I'm saying, Tricky Boy? You need a good killer app in order to really justify getting a new system, whether it's a portable or a main system. Oops, I fucked up. Yeah, I remember back in the day you didn't even have a smartphone. Now that you've gotten a smartphone, you can't go back. You don't even know how you lived without it. That's what I was talking about. Spending time with your dog, you mean? That's cool. Discovering nature. All right, boss time. back at me. He reflects it at an angle, which is annoying. How am I supposed to... This is the way you're supposed to do it. That's too hard! fast enough. I don't know, like, how you're supposed to do this, like, what the intended method is. 
All right, there. Jeez, holy crap. <laughs> He's tough because he just reflects it. Not, he doesn't reflect it to me. He, he's so fucking retarded. predict where he's gonna hit it to next. I guess it's always to the left, right? Left, right? Thank you so much. You're so brave. You're gonna save the world. Temple. We have no time. We must go now. Okay. So these are like extra lives? Oh. Yeah, I'm probably gonna close up now, too. Yeah! It's the shortest stream tonight, but that's okay. Hmm. Gotta wait until I save. 
save though. Save. Okay. So, yeah, that's it for tonight. A little shorter than usual, but that's okay. It's a bit under two hours. Like, uh, 13 minutes until you hit the two hour mark. So that's alright. Yeah, so we'll be streaming this uh, until we beat it. This is part of the Zelda Thon. Uh, it's okay. Um, it's not like terrific. Um, but it's alright. I'm digging it. Uh, definitely, I, I like the graphics. They're pretty cool. And this game would have been a lot better if they just ditched the stupid uh, GBA connectivity crap, which is totally useless. Like, you don't need it. I mean, yeah, some guys can go into, like, little caves on their own, but, like, they could have figured out a way to make it work. <laughs> you don't need another screen for this shit. Everyone can be playing on the same screen. It's fucking stupid. But, it is what it is, and as a single player experience, it's not terrible. Um, yeah, it's, it's okay. But yeah, that's it for tonight. We'll pick this up again tomorrow. Thank you, Churkis, for streaming with me. It's an honor and a pleasure. Have a good night.